What is up? <laughs> Globetrotters, what I like to do for the GeoGuessr Daily Challenge is we are incepted into a location somewhere in the world. We got to move around, figure out where we are. We got five shots, a perfect score of 5,000 points. If you think you know where we are, please shout out the answers. But as always, no Googling. You do the Googlers. Okay. <laughs> this is Middle East. Almost pretty, almost sure. And Arabic? No. What do we, yeah, we do. Okay, we got French and Arabic. Okay. Where's Samed? Oh, we got Tunisia? <laughs> Finley. Finley knows where we are. I was going to say Algeria from the guest, but Tunisia also applies. Algeria, Tunisia. Okay, okay, okay. Could this be your homeland, sir? We think of Tunisia? Histoire de corps. See, my problem is I don't read Arabic, so I'm not going to get half the language. This is a tune easier. Oh, maybe. Trying to find the city name. Leona? Every time I get two jokers, I think of you. Every time. Can you look behind? All right. You want me to go the other way? Uh, this way. You want me to go this way? Oh, to the restaurant sign. The GeoGuessr car is followed by another car. What is the area code? 40. Tunisia. Okay. So are we thinking Tunis? Thinking the capital of Tunisia? What are we thinking? Everyone's saying Tunisia. Can we do better than that? Look at the van, see if there's a website. Yes. It, I don't know if it looks like Tunis. Okay. I mean, you know what would be really helpful is someone who could read Arabic script. Uh, <laughs> save me. Chad says I like Morocco. I don't think Morocco speaks French, though. Dar es Salaam. Dar es Salaam. Is there a Dar es Salaam in Tunisia? Algeria do for sure. Okay, we have a difference of opinion. Maybe not Morocco. Dar es Salaam. 20 seconds. Anyone got something to say? Let me know. Dar es Salaam is Tanzania. Yeah, I don't think this is Tanzania. I think this is much more likely Tunisia. But we didn't get the city. Where? City where? There it is. All right. Question number uh, question number two. Spanish language. Likely South America. Sun position south. What do we get from this? Alcade. Alcade is Guatemala. Is it a neighborhood in Guatemala City? Silorian. Guatemala on the sign. Thank you, sir. Okay. San Pedro Saca Tepequez. San Pedro. San Lucas, San Juan, San Pedro, second to Pequez, ladies and gentlemen. We found the neighborhood. Okay, so now what is this? Okay. We're facing north. We're heading up a hill.
Line up a road angle. Yeah, we're on a curving road that's going up a hill, right? And we're north of the city. So we're up here. Right? Now we're heading down into the city. Cities to the south of us, southeast of us. Yeah. Yeah. No, that's southwest. Hmm. Are we up here? Pin? Go back to pin. Ah, go back to pin. Okay. All right. Pin is here. Facing north. Fabricamos. Fabricamos. Yeah. All right. That was pretty good. Question number three. Okay. We are, we end up on train tracks. We're getting GeoGuessr on train tracks here. This is rough. What? Okay. Where do we think? Okay. I think we're in India, right? Maybe Africa? Maybe Africa. You think Malaysia? I think Africa. We're heading north on some train to try to find language. Yeah. But you like Africa. Africa seems reasonable. Palm trees and camera quality. I don't know that we need the Mortal Kombat extended mix, though. This sounds like a bit, uh, bit excessive. Never seen something like this in Africa? Okay. Do so you think it's more India? You passed the town. Good job. Africa's not a big place. Yeah, indeed. It doesn't really help all that much, right? It's like, oh, Africa, great. <laughs> really narrowed that down. Southern India. Southern India, Bangladesh. Okay. I can dig that. But, like, we're on fucking train tracks, though. So how am I supposed to get past this? What are they growing? There? I know, I need language, too, man. You're telling me. Indonesia? Really? No, I don't think so. I like southern India better than, Indo than Indonesia. Go back to the pin, he says. What, you want to go the other way? Coastal Africa. Yeah, southern India. Southern India seems plausible. That's the closest we're going to get to language. Big mountains. Don't lose your train of thought. Stay on track. I love you, Chad. <laughs> that, ladies and gentlemen, is uh, what we refer to in the business as a zinger. Uh <laughs> what a gent. Andal Dabia with the prime. Thank you for the tier one. And thank you, Andre Hedges. You guys are all showering me with uh, good vibes. Thank you, Andre. Oh, honey. Oh, baby. Thank you, Andre. Not bad. Southern India. Outside of Quimbatore. Question number four. <coughs> okay. Yeah, with the founder badge. Damn right, man. Been around a long time, Andre. You remember that? How long have I been on Twitch now? More than three years. Those three years went by in a flash, guys, I'll tell you. 
does not feel like three years of my life. Yeah, I think Africa again. You think Ghana? Okay, can go Ghana. Why is there Street View on this train track? <laughs> yeah, seems very plausible for Africa. Go into map. Because it was Trekker. It has been crazy. Not going to get it? Not going to do it. Wouldn't be prudent. Some dude went on the train with the Google camera on his back. Report back to it. Do you think it's northern Ghana? Like tamale? That's one hot tamale. Go Morocco. Kenya. Okay, we got all, we got differing opinions in the chat. So far, I see no signage. Road west of Tamale. This is just your east-west road. West. This one? What is that command see how long you've been following? You're asking me? <laughs> or are you asking someone by the National Park? Young Boo. The one south of that. Super straight road. This is just that one. Thanks, Finn. You just you just know the answer. Without Googling. We would never accuse Finley Pope of Googling. Try to line up the east-west part. How would you even Google this? Indeed. That's a good point. Very valid point. I don't fucking know. Do I ever cage the elephant? What's that? It was on the other side of Tamale. Final question. This looks like a U.S. city. We got the Escalade with rims. All right. Wait. Is that Ontario? Are those Ontario plates? Doesn't look. No, this has got to be USA. Looks Canadian. Okay. You think this is Ontario? It does kind of look Canadian to me. Those might have been Ontario plates. Use the lights road. Canada. Okay, we got Canada and USA flag. So we're probably on the border. I knew he would end up in Canada. Interesting. Very interesting. Where in Canada and USA? Raytheon. You think it's Vermont? Hmm. See, I see Ontario plates. Buffalo. We get an area code on the bus. 721 Ontario. We are in the province of Ontario. Simcoe, Muskoka. Okay, Simcoe, Muskoka. I know where that is. Home support. Simcoe, Muskoka. Simcoe, Muskoka is up here. So this is Lake Simcoe, and Muskoka is to the north of it up here. This is Muskoka. So what city are we in? Transportation services. There's a Raytheon. What city are we in in Ontario? Um, okay, let's go back to the pin. We're like Aurelia or some shit? Dude, fucking dude's got the fanciest Escalade in town. How do we get to a main road? Would this be Aurelia? Young Street, okay. Young and Russell. Russell? We got a Young Street. Okay, that's a lake. What lake is that? Is that Simcoe? Are we heading? Is this Barry? Are we on Young Street? Is that Simcoe? Young goes up to, okay, so Young goes up here and hits Georgina and then curves around the lake and goes to Barry. Is that? Are we actually on Young Street? 45 seconds. I want to get this. 
try to find Barry. I know where Barry is. Barry's here. You think it's Barry? Is there a Raytheon in Barry, though? Young Street doesn't actually go that way. It becomes Highway 11. You think it's Barry? Can't remember what part of Canada P is from. I'm from um, Toronto, so I'm due south of this. If I if this is where I think this is, what lake is this? Tiflin by the bay, Midland town of Midland. Midland is 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 is, is where's fucking Midland? There, it's up here. We're in Midland, Penetanguishene. All right, we're very close, and we're at the lake, and there is a Raytheon here, right? Midland. Oh, oh! fuck yeah! <laughs> that feels good. <laughs> Four degrees is fucking Midland. We found it. We found the town in time. <laughs> that felt pretty good. It's a great one to end on, folks. 4994 feels damn good. And you want to see me do my hometown? This is what my hometown looks like. Always getting on. I, I don't know how many times I've ever gotten Ontario in the Daily Challenge. Okay, so this is like the junction. Bloor and Davenport. Okay. Havelock and Lindsay. Okay, so we're heading south to Bloor on Havelock. No, we're set, we're heading south to College on Havelock. Okay, ho College and Havelock. So College. Remind me where Havelock is. It's one of these. It's like by Dufferin. Havelock and Lindsay. But we're not on there. We're on Lindsay. And we're in a number of houses from the corner. One, two, three, four. I think this might be Toronto. You're on to something, sir. All right, we go downtown. Is that a federal building? Federal government. This is Hockey Hall of Fame, right? Yeah. See all the Stanley Cup shit? This is the Hockey Hall of Fame <laughs> in Toronto. Who likes hockey? This is Meridian Hall, uh, formerly uh, the Hummingbird Center, formerly O'Keefe Center. That just tells you I'm really old. Front and young. Toronto hasn't seen a Stanley Cup in a long time, and I hope they never see one again. I tire of hearing of it. Nothing would make me happier than to never have to hear about hockey ever again in my entire life. Question number three. Okay. Uh, Castor Incorporated. They have a Welsh flag. Very exciting. Um, got some row houses. This looks like a nicer sort of like old downtown neighbor. This is more like north of Bloor. It's like a Yorkville-y type avenue, 151 Avenue Road, yeah? Is this Yorkville? Did I fucking spot that? Is that spot on? Avenue Road and Davenport. Hey, 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 it is Yorkville, just north of Yorkville. Avenue Road and Davenport. Down here, Davenport, and it hooks down to Avenue Road, and we're on Piers Avenue, I'm guessing. All, no, we're on this. I'm actually not sure where we are. We're on the corner of Bedford and what's the name of the street? Bedford and what? Bernard. 
or south of Avenue. One, two. These houses are incredible. Three. These houses must be worth so much fucking money. Four from there. One, two, three, four. So I spoke with the help in Territorial IO Discord. They said it used to be a setting, but it's disabled. Why would they disable it? I I can't do post production. <laughs> I do cryogenics. Pete, it never seems to amaze me how much knowledge you have about the geography of your own hometown. I mean, just think if you live somewhere very long and you have a great memory, it just kind of stays. You know, and you, you slowly map it all out and you drive around as a kid. You learn where you where am I today? Where are we going today, Dad? You know? And you start driving yourself. You have to. You don't want to get lost. You look at the map, and you know where you're going. I think I do all right in these Toronto questions. Foresters, Foresters. Oh, okay. So Foresters. This is the Foresters building by the DVP, right? Eleven Foresters. What's that? Let's see. Foresters and Ferrand. I think the DVP is like here. So for it's like Eglinton and this goes out to Egg, right? That's Egg. Yeah, because that's the fucking LRT that they haven't fucking. It's been built for a decade, but we haven't been able to ride on it for some stupid reason. Okay. Foresters, DVP and Egg, Ferrand. Ferrand and what? What's the cross street? I lived in town for 50 years. I learned a little about past Pape and Eglinton. <laughs> Did you drive or were you a transit kind of guy? We're in a parking lot. Okay, so we head south from this parking lot. We hit. Ferrand. No, it's Forster's Lane. We're in here. But which parking lot? Let's see. Tribeca Lofts. Yes. Yeah, we're right there. We're at this junction. Perfect. 50 years downtown TO. <laughs> Letter care. Okay, right on. So yeah, you know your your specific area perfectly well. I grew up in the burbs, man. So I was driving around all and Toronto's a big city, like in, just in terms of area. So I've been driving around all sorts of places. So that looks like the wall for the 401. That's the wall for the 401. I'm pretty sure. Or it could be the wall for the QE dub. Yeah, that's the QE Dub, South Service. Yeah, QEW. Uh, south Service roads were facing north, so we're south of the QEW. What's the major? Live Oak. Live Oak and South Service, what's the major? Okay, we hop on, actually. Now we're on the QEW. How do we not do that? And now, you know what? We'll get the major from the next cross street at the highway. Next exit on the highway is, we're heading east. Next exit is... Evans Ave West Mall. Okay, so we're right here. We're right at the end of Mississauga where QEW meets Evans Ave West Mall. Live Oak and South Service Road. Cool. Live Oak South Service and we are south of that. It's around the corner. This is an yeah, this is just a corner. Okay. And we're at this guy's house. Yeah, we're at this guy's house. Whoppa. Ladies and gentlemen, thank you for helping me. Hope you enjoyed. Until next time, wherever you find yourself in this big old world, I wish you the very best. Keep on stacking caps and slapping noobs. Oh,